What's up guys? I am so excited to be back. So I have completely um, changed everything basically. Some of you guys may have seen me. I have already had YouTube videos before on a different channel. I got rid of everything, deleted all of it. Um, you might be able to find like a video or two from before. Sorry, I'm. this is like a weird position. Um, you might be able to find like a video or two from before. But... I've deleted everything. I am completely restarting. So with that, you know, I've rebranded. Um, but a lot of you guys probably haven't seen me. So my name's Alyssa Kimber. I do makeup, um, mostly any kind of beauty style related um, videos. And then I really wanted to kind of start doing some other videos as well. I'm not going to get into that today, but I'm really excited and I think it's something that you guys would really enjoy and it's going to be something a little different and I think that you'll get to see me on a more personal level and get to know a lot more about my life. So um, with that, um, I'm losing my voice today. It's a lot worse I think in the video when I'm doing um, this look, but yeah. So anyway, um, I hope that you guys enjoy it. I really hope that you guys subscribe and leave a lot of feedback, okay? I really want you guys to be active um, because I really like ideas and I love feeding off of what other people have to say and, you know, I really want to keep this like a positive vibe on this channel. So, you know, there's the door. Um, there's the exit button. Like, you guys can leave if you don't like it. So whatever. Anyway, I'm like so excited. I'm freaking pumped to be here and doing this again. Um, I love doing this, so I'm excited to have you guys be part of it, and I really hope that you guys subscribe to the channel and, you know, can keep up with me and what I'm doing and that, um, vice versa. So this is going to be the look that I've done today, and I know my hair looks like a mess right now. It's even worse in the video when I was shooting, so I'm sorry. But, um, yeah, so let's go ahead and get to it. What's up, guys? So I'm back. Today I was just going to do a makeup look for what I do every day because I have questions about how I do my makeup. Like, I freaking love making YouTube videos. I missed it so much, and I'm going to be consistent. Like, this summer... You guys are going to see a lot of me, so sorry my hair is a mess today, but my Makeup Forever HD foundation, and the color I'm currently using is 145, so I just take some and put it all over my face, you know. Okay, I never understand those people that are like, you just need one pea size. And it's gonna cover your whole face like no that has never happened for me but then again I like full coverage because I have um freckles and I don't really like them showing so try to like okay and then I use my beauty blender and right now it's just wet down with some water to make it a little bit of a little bit of a little bit moist um it just makes it easier to blend out oh my gosh I sound like a guy this is awful I hate not listening to music like I always have to have music on and like these were supposed to be baby hairs and somehow like full hairs escaped whatever <laughs> contour palette and this is in the color light. The 101 Sephora brush. I use one side for the concealer, one side for the contour, just because I'm freaking lazy and I'm not about to be like getting other brushes for this. So I just use the lightest color first, which is in Fair. This is extremely difficult without like a real mirror. Okay, so then I use this. Um, darker color for my contour which is going to be in Havana so I'm just flipping that brush over to the other side right there just placing it on the side of my nose this is just going to create the illusion that my nose is um, thinner 
and every person's nose shape is different so you'll have to adjust it according to what your nose is like um so I'm gonna take some of this light color again and now that I've done my contour on the sides I'm gonna take it down the middle okay and what that's gonna do is bring draw the light to the center of your nose so that it again creates a thinner effect and then I just take a tiny bit and dot it around my face because naturally you do have shadowing um, around around your hairline there same with down here you're gonna go around the jawline it's just gonna thin your face out like I'll go in with the tip of it first just because it's easy to get in those corners and then I really blend it out with that um, so yeah and then down the center and to the sides and my trick with the beauty blender I mean, it's not really a trick but like I like to roll it as I um, am using it because I feel like it really blends it better if you're just patting it it's not really blending or anything like that put it down the neck because you do not want to have that awful like dark neck light face or dark face and light neck like that's just the worst and for me like my face does not tan my body will tan but my face doesn't so I have to wear darker makeup like I just have to because I oh um because I have to try and match it so like that's really the only thing I can do I really prefer not to put self tanner on my face just because like I don't have sensitive skin or anything like that and I am not prone to breakouts but like putting self tanner on my face will make me break out like you're putting this like heavy product on your face like you just can't do that it has no room to breathe it, it's like it's stuck to your face so I'm not doing that so next I use the Hula bronzer from benefit this is literally like my favorite 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 product ever like I love this stuff so much and then I'm just gonna use the my Sephora um brush in 75 so now I'm just gonna go back over it with this BAM that's done. Okay, so next. Oh my gosh, this hair is going to drive me crazy. Like, you are so not supposed to be there. I'll break it. I use the color nylon from MAC. This is just going to be my brow bone color. Um, I'm really sorry. I don't know what this color is, but it's just a matte brown. So... You guys either probably will recognize it. If you do think you know what it is, you should tag it below because I'm going to run out eventually and have to replace it. And I love this stuff. And then I, after I've placed the product on the um, lid and I've kind of blended it around on my eyelid, then I drag it up into my crease just a little bit. And then it kind of transitions into the highlight. So... Yeah, we're blended, okay, and it looks freaking weird right now as I'm looking in the camera, so I'm hoping when I'm editing this, it doesn't look the same, but it probably will. Oh, I'm gonna curl my lashes real quick. Um, I'm gonna be honest, I'm like a little bit disturbed that this is gonna be my first video on YouTube with my new channel, and that my voice sounds so deep. <laughs> I use the MAC Fluid Liner in Black Track. It's number 22. It just looks like that. So I'm going to just place this on my top lash line. And again, everyone's eye shape is different. How I place my eyeliner is I do it a lot um, thicker right in the center. And then it gets... Um, We're going to wait for this car to pass because it's freaking loud. That might not be a car. Next, I use the Falsies Maybelline Falsies Mascara. And that 
was it. All done. This is not okay. Okay. Anyway. So, there is... Yeah. So now, that's my little... So, uh, yeah. Just keep in touch and go follow me on Instagram. It's Alyssa underscore Kimber. So, I'll go and have that linked down um, as well. Alright, so thanks guys!